Hi, welcome once again to the Carpenter Shop where we are spending time looking at some things and trying to discover who it is that God has created us to be and what we're supposed to be in the world around us. In Romans 8, 37, it says this, Yet in all these things we are more than conquerors through Him who loved us. I don't know if you've ever been somewhere and you've tried to walk into a restricted area. There's usually a sign that's posted there, maybe there's a locked gate or a locked door, but there was a reason that you wanted to be on the other side of that. Maybe you had to get past a security guard. Maybe you had to go past a security shack. Maybe it was a neighborhood where there was a bar that was there preventing you and you had to call somebody to let you in. And you find out in that moment that um, if you don't have the right credentials, if you don't have the right authorization, um, you simply can't get where you want to go. Now, there are some who are known to skirt those guardrails and um, kind of go over those barriers and just kind of go on their own, and that's not what I'm really talking about here. But um, the reality is that if you have someone, though, who knows the code, someone who has permission, someone who has authority, then they can look back at that guard or they can look back at that gatekeeper or they can give you that code that you need because you're with them. That verse that I just read you, in all things, because we are with Him, we are more than conquerors. See, as we face things in life, we can do our best, and there's some things that we probably can whip on our own. There's some things that we probably can push back, and there's some things that we probably can beat. But at the end of the day, because we are a follower of Christ, and because He is with us and we are with Him, we are, as Scripture describes us, more than conquerors. In other words, we're with Him, and because of that, we're more with Him than we could be without Him. How does that look in your life? Have you ever thought about that? Have you ever taken the time to sit back and think, how is my life different because Jesus is there? And take a few moments and honestly do that, because if you take inventory and your life is no different with Him, then you need to ask yourself, well, what's wrong? I promise you, what's wrong is not God's problem, it's your problem. And if you'll take the time, you will discover that when you allow God to work in your life, amazing things will happen and He'll do amazing things with you. And so remember that you're more than a conqueror. You have access. You have access to every place the King wants you to go. And when you get there, you'll discover He's with you each step of the way. I look forward to joining you next time here in the Carpenter Shop.